students from Infant 5, it's me, Teacher Sara, on our English time. So, are you ready for our class? Let's sing our song. Hello, 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 hello. How are you? How are you? I'm good, I'm great, I'm good, I'm great. How about you? How about you? Hello, 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 hello. How are you? How are you? I'm good, I'm great, good, I'm great. How about you? How about you? Na 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 Hey, na 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 na. Hey, so how are you, my students? Are you happy or sad? Tell me here. Yay! Everybody is happy. So nice. I'm happy too because. We are here together and yes I'm here on our English room and it's so empty because you are not here but I hope we can see each other soon okay well so today it's so interesting that I have a rainbow um, let me put here I have this rainbow behind and today is uh, the, the beginning of the week that we are going to talk about a story Yes, it's a holiday. Let me tell you a little bit about this holiday. Uh, this holiday, it's about St. Patrick's Days. But teacher Sara, who was St. Patrick's Days? Let me tell you a very, very short story about that. Okay, my students. This man, his name is Patrick. Patrick, okay? And once upon a time he was a young man that he was born a very very long time ago okay and one day he was at the beach and he was captured and he traveled from england to ireland and then there he was a slave a slave means escravo in english and when he was in Ireland, he worked as a shepherd. Yes, it was like a pasto. He used to take care of the animals like sheep and pigs. Patrick was often so hungry that he had to eat the animal's food. Patrick had a very lonely life and spent most of his time praying. One night, Patrick heard a voice in a dream. It was God. He told Patrick to leave the mountain and to go to the harbor in Country Water Fort. So Patrick did exactly what the voice said. And he could escape from Ireland. He went back to uh, British, to England, okay? Uh, he studies and he becomes a priest. Ele se tornou um padre. He becomes a priest and then he returned to Ireland do you know that he used to take the sham rock to pray to teach a lot of things and nowadays people around the world they celebrate St. Patrick days and how do they celebrate that can you see here in this picture people use colors from Ireland from Ireland's flag green white and orange yes and at school kids do a lot of games a lot of tricks but there is other thing the story of st patrick days mixes a little bit with the folklore from ireland you know folklore yes here in our country in brazil we talk about sassy cook yes so from ireland they talk about leprechaun let me show you about a leprechaun. Before I talk about leprechauns, let's remember this. Do you remember what the, is the name of this picture? Yes, it's a rainbow. And on a rainbow, I can see some colors. Let's review the colors. Let me check if you know. Uh, say with me, okay? Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, dark blue and purple yes but there is a mystery what can we find in the end of the rainbow 
I have here a cloud. But what is in the other side? Can you tell me? In the end of a rainbow, I can find a pot of gold. Yes, but how can I find that? How can I see uh, a rainbow? How can I catch a pot of gold? There is someone that protects magically the pot of gold. It's the person that owns that green hat. But who has a green top hat like that? Do you know? Yes, it's a leprechaun. Leprechaun are little men like this and they are very fast and they are magic and they protect the pot of gold. But if you catch a leprechaun, you can make him to give you the pot of gold. But teacher Sara, how can I catch a leprechaun? Mm, it's a mystery. So next class, I, you, I will tell you a story about how we can catch a leprechaun. Okay? All right. So are you curious about how can we catch a leprechaun? So don't miss the next class because I'm going to tell you, okay, everything about leprechauns. All right? So I hope you are good and it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our bye bye song. Bye bye, goodbye. Bye bye, bye bye, goodbye. Goodbye. I can clap my hands, can you? I can stomp my feet, can you? I can clap my hands. I can stamp my feet. Bum, 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 bye bye, goodbye. Bye, 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 goodbye, goodbye. I hope you can see you next class because I'm going to tell you how to catch a leprechaun, okay?